And next, our second semifinal of this middleweight tournament. Enter the cage, fighting out of the blue corner from Ukraine, Pavel Kuz. And the remaining place in the finals will be between this man and one other, Pavel Kush. He is representing Combat Dobro, has a record of 12 and 2, and is 23 years of age. This is a very interesting matchup indeed. Two guys who have gotten through to the semis due to injuries to previous competitors, and two fighters that couldn't be more different in their approach to a fight. Kush is a submission specialist, 12 wins by submission. He gamely took the fight on 10 days' notice. And interestingly, this has made Sherdog's list for April's top tussles. Yeah, Pavel Kush is a master on the ground. We mentioned in the intro to the show that you know he's a former Sambo world champion and every single one of his wins is by way of submission. His key to this fight has got to be to not let John Phillips get a single shot off, close the distance, dive at those legs. He's got such a good pedigree in attacking leg locks. Three victories by heel hook and a toe hold on his record. If he can get in on Phillips' legs quick, that's his best shot of putting him away early. Something quite key though, Josh, he has a very suspect chin. And there's one man that can take advantage of that. His opponent fighting out of the red corner from the United Kingdom. Here is John Phillips. And that man I was talking about is making his way to the cage. It is John Phillips representing Gracie Baja Predators. He has a record of 14-4 and one no contest. He is 26 years of age. Now here's a little equation for you. Four ounce gloves plus John Phillips' left hand equals lethal weapon. And that left hand has been honed on the amateur boxing circuit, including time with the Welsh Olympic team. Much like his opponent, Phillips losers have gone to top contenders, Tom Watson, Frank Trigg, Dennis and Sutherland, and Jimmy Warhead. To firm up his skill set, he spent some time away from Gracie Baja and went out to Extreme Couture in Las Vegas to work on his wrestling. Now, Phillips is a big middleweight. He cuts down from 100 kgs. He's about 95 kilos right now. It's common knowledge he's missed weight in the past, but he's so much more serious about his fight career now, Josh. Yeah, he's really going to bring it. Phillips does have good takedown defense, and it's going to play right into his hands against Pavel Kush. Pavel favors those upper body tie-ups, and that's where Phillips really has no trouble stopping the incoming assault. But just look at the size of him here Absolutely. as a middleweight. Absolutely huge in his 20th professional contest. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, this semi-final middleweight tournament matchup. Three rounds scheduled inside the cage. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A combat sample fighter standing six feet even. Official weight 184 and three quarter pounds. As a professional, this veteran brings 12 victories and just two defeats into the cage. Hailing from Kiev, Ukraine, here is Pavel Kush. And next is opponent across the cage, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist standing five feet, 11 inches tall. Weighing at 185 and one quarter pounds, he too a veteran with 14 victories, four defeats, and one no contest from Swansea, Wales, UK. Here is John Phillips. Referee in charge, once again, Neil Hall. Well, John, both these guys can finish the fight in an instant and they hardly ever go out of the first round. Josh, I'm not sure the judges will need to sharpen their pencils for this. But Neil Hall is now between these two men in our other final semi-final of the middleweight tournament. We have John Phillips in the black with Pavel Kush in the blue. Well, immediately Kush looks for that outside single, hits it beautifully. And oh, and, and he is looking for that leg lock straight in for the Achilles lock. He's gone for it, and we can see the grimace on his face as he's really trying to put that in. Yeah, he's got the leg switching for the oh, heel hook. Oh, he's got the heel hook. Oh, and he's got it. He's got it. Pavel Kush has stopped John Phillips. And John Phillips has been finished by a heel hook. Wow, and he's I, not happy about Kush I think it was. It after I think it was on for a little bit longer. But take nothing away, Josh. Pavel Kush has just defeated John Phillips in the very... <laughs> first round well we, <laughs> we said it john if he just goes straight for the legs and looks for those submissions i think it was frustrating on john's on john's part i mean he's just been taken out I, I, 
fantastic strategy by Pavel Kush. I, I, wow. <laughs> I'm speechless. I didn't see it going that way. Let's hand it over to Joe. Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes 25 seconds. Round number one. Submission by Hill Hook, your winner. And moving on to the finals, Pavel Kush. And Josh, what a sweet story. Pavel Kush came onto Cage Warriors for a local show. He proved his worth, did so very well. And now he finds himself in the finals and potentially taking away the middleweight world championship belt.